I am part of this group of 120 amazing, brilliant people. We're all pro-vaccine, we're all pro-science. And lo and behold, people started emailing me literally from all over the world saying they were having similar reactions. One found two and two found four and four found eight and we just kept growing. So we, we started a small group. But it was just such a relief to find others like me. Late December of 2020, I had a severe reaction that started 30 minutes after the vaccine and Five minutes after receiving my vaccine, I had a reaction. Several of us that had lost control of their legs. Um, and then it started impacting kids. We started hearing from parents of children that were affected. Just progressed into a, a very severe neurological illness. I was part of the AstraZeneca clinical trial here in the United States. And um, just like everyone else in our group, unfortunately, I experienced severe neurological problems to the point where I too felt like I was going to die. Having intense, immense side effects of these neurological reactions. And it was the scariest time of my life by far. Tingling, numbness, burning pain in various parts of the body. I have 15 different side effects that have been created from the vaccine. 15. It has spread now to my entire body. So when I'm flaring up. I have those sensations basically from head to toe. I've had that from day one and I'm talking massive swollen lymph nodes. It is unbearable pain. Menstrual issues with women. Anything from ruling out MS to transverse myelitis to stroke to diabetes. I've had all the tests. I, the only thing I could do, like you said, is I would just cry and I would, I would walk over to my husband and say, there is something wrong. There is something wrong with me just one person to be able to say, I see you. It was huge. And, and nobody believes you. It was just like this electrical sensation going through my body. And that's when it was the worst and the most unbearable. But it's just been the absolute unknown that is kind of disheartening. We all wanted to get vaccinated too. We're not anti-vaxxers. We are pro-science, pro-vaccine. I was living minute by minute, just breathing in and out, just reminding myself to breathe. I was literally bedridden. We're just trying to get appropriate medical help. I mean, I think one of the hard things about these neurological reactions is that on the outside, we look normal. And on the inside, you know. Um, I was terrified, I was scared. I didn't know if I was gonna live, um, full on crying. But the brain fog started to take a toll and, um, Sorry. Um, As we have mentioned many, many, many times, none of us are anti-vax. Truly, I, I feared for my life. Um, I was that ill. I personally have a lot of concerns of moving forward um, about neurological damage and degenerative neuro diseases that could later impact my life. I feel like I will be looking over my shoulder um, for the rest of my life. I made a will and I made funeral arrangements. <laughs> Am I going to die? Because I'm really, really afraid. If you send like a message to people like us that are injured at the end of this, I just want them to know that they're not alone. I'm convinced that there is one person out there. It's just going to take one person who has the courage to stand up against the cancel culture that we're all facing right now. And somebody who's brave enough to be able to say something's going on here and we need to investigate it so we can help these people.